to the ultra MOOC. So first of all, when you need to speak a location, it will not ask you where you are and you need to put your address. You, your address, it will be done automatically. But more than that, if I take it, and I believe this Google has, I can navigate it and use all the great compute power that you've got an i5 and i core, and I'm not sure that many other things will be able to deliver such an application, and at the same time, enjoy both worlds. So we can see over here, and again, if you'll be able to try it later on, how the sensors are working with these ultrabooks. And I can see already people asking cynical, yes, but it's a clamshell. So let me promise you two things. First of all, it's very comfortable to do it with a clamshell. It's beautiful. But some of the systems are going to be clamshells like this. It's a base. But if you'd like to do it, you'll have it as a tablet. Thank you, guys. <laughs> By the way, this section, did you hear what they just said? <laughs> but what you can see over here is the way that you'll see many of those. We call it sliders or convertibles. We just open it, we took it, and then we can take the compute power that we've got in a core processor and use all the greatness that we can do on a PC. But if you want to do it as a tablet, you can have your tablet with you, and then you can have the touch that you have seen, you can have the sensor, although my personal belief <laughs> is that people will use touch screen with their ultrabook, even in a clamshell, and people will use the sensors, and after a few weeks that you use it, you'll be surprised, you, you will not be able to do anything without it. So what you see over here is the ultrabooks, and we've got it on Microsoft, Windows 8, that you all have seen the tiles, and it will run even better. So the first example was an Ultrabook with Windows 7, and once we are working with Microsoft or Windows 8, we'll be able to get even better experience and having the tile experience with the rest of the applications.